March 20th, 1995. Morning rush hour in Tokyo. In crowded subways, terrorists release the deadly nerve gas sarin, killing and maiming thousands. Shizui Takahashi's husband, Kazuma, died while trying to help others. In recent years, terrorists began obtaining weapons of mass destruction and using them to inflict suffering on civilians anywhere, wherever they choose. The most forceful action taken thus far is United Nations Security Council Resolution 1540, which UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon says is essential to keep people safe. We cannot afford to be complacent in the face of such a grave threat. Resolution 1540 requires every government to adopt and enforce laws to prevent terrorists from acquiring and using weapons of mass destruction. Over the past 10 years, we have worked for universal implementation of Resolution 1540. The world today is obviously better able to prevent WMD terrorism. The most effective way to actually implement uh, Resolution 1540 uh, is to work together internationally. That means all of the governments, the member states of the United Nations, it means international civil society. It's impossible to fully heal the wounds of the past, but forceful UN actions like Resolution 1540 may reduce fear and panic, bringing the world closer to safety and peaceful cohabitation. <laughs>